What causes deep vein thrombosis and how can we stop it? Deep vein thrombosis, DVT, is a blood clot in one of your deep veins, usually in the leg. It can cause redness, swelling, aching, and make walking difficult. If part of the clot breaks off and goes to the lungs, this can cause pulmonary embolism. This is a life-threatening emergency. Around 60,000 people develop DVT in the UK every year. You are at risk if the blood flow in your legs slows down. This can happen if you spend a long time without moving, for example after surgery or on a long-haul flight. People with heart failure are at increased risk too, because your heart is less effective at pumping blood. DVT can be prevented with anti-clotting medications, such as warfarin or heparin. But these increase the risk of dangerous bleeding, including some strokes. We need a new and better way to prevent DVT. Thanks to public donations, the BHF has funded Dr Alexander Brill and BHF Professor Steve Watson to explore how DVT happens. Platelets are tiny blood cells which stop bleeding. For example, after you cut your finger. They recognise damaged blood vessels and then stick together to form a clot. Scientists are learning how molecules on the surface of platelets, called receptors, are involved in forming blood clots. Dr Brill and colleagues discovered that mice that don't have a platelet receptor called CLEC2 are protected from DVT. In the veins, CLEC2 binds to a molecule called podoplanin. The team showed that using drugs to stop binding can prevent DVT. This treatment doesn't increase the risk of bleeding. The next step is to prove this works in human veins. After that, clinical trials could begin with patients. We hope this will lead to a treatment that protects people from blood clotting, preventing DVT and saving lives. Help us fund more research like this. Visit bhf.org.uk slash donate.